Okay, so we have to differentiate this function, so solution. All right, here uh, we have 5x squared times the cotangent of x, so we'll use the product rule. And here we have 6 times the cosecant of 7x. Now, since 6 is a constant, it kind of just hangs out while we take the derivative of cosecant. So let's do it. Let's take the derivative. So let's take the derivative of f. Now, keep in mind, if you have two functions, f and g, the product rule says that it's the derivative of the first piece times the second plus the first times the derivative of the second. Most books uh, don't, don't do it this way. All right, so the derivative of the first piece is 10x, right? It's easy, times the second piece, which is cotangent x plus the first, which is 5x squared, times the derivative of the second piece. And the derivative of cotangent is negative cosecant squared x minus 6 times the derivative of cosecant. Now here we have to use the chain rule. So the derivative of cosecant is negative cosecant 7x cotangent 7x times 7, right? That's the derivative of the inside. Uh, that's it. Let's just clean it up. So f prime of x, this will be 10x cotangent x minus 5x squared cosecant squared x. And then here we have a negative, a negative that's going to give us a positive. And the 6 and the 7 will give us 42. So 42 cosecant 7x cotangent 7x. And that is the answer. So we had to use the product rule. And we also had to know the derivatives of cosecant and cotangent. But otherwise, not too difficult.